Hi, I want to um, show you some little tips on playing with sound again and I want to create an effect as if uh, the sound is coming out of a telephone handset. So you first of all have to think of what sort of sound comes out of a telephone handset and it's a very small speaker so you find that the sound um, has no bass, um, has no real treble and all the mid frequencies are boosted and also all telephones uh, sounds are compressed so you have to compress the sound as well as EQ it so here's a little example I've recorded my voice earlier here's the message thank you for calling I'm sorry all our operators are busy at the moment someone will be with you shortly your call is held in a queue but as you can hear, that, that sounds very studio. Um, so what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to go to... Uh, I'm working... This is Sony Vegas. I'll put a link to information about Sony Vegas in the information box. But on any sound system that allows you to have multiple tracks and also as it allows you to do um, EQing has various different plug-in functions. And Sony Vegas has a very good set of plug-in functions. So what I'm going to do first of all is I'm going to I've gone to compressor. So I'm going to squeeze, start squeezing the voice um, to give it that telephone effect. So here we go. Let's just try. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. So what I'm actually doing here is I've actually got the compression set quite high. When you see the red lights functioning, that, that is when it's actually squeezing the sound. So I want to squeeze it as much as possible. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. So I think that's probably compressed enough. The next stage is to alter the EQ to give it that telephone sound, which means taking the bass and treble off. So again, on Sony Vegas, I've already got EQ here. Um, the straight line represents the unaltered sound with all of its frequencies. Uh, this is the bass down, which I will want to do like that. Let's just... Uh, That like that and I also want to bring the treble right down so what's happening here is is the bass literally after about 640 Hertz is rolling straight off and after about 1.2 K the top end is rolling straight off I'll also want to push up the middle so there you can see the sound all the bass has been cut the middle's been pushed up and the high frequencies have been lowered so in theory this should sound a bit like a telephone. It may be a bit too loud, and I'll have to bring the levels down. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. That's still sounding a little bit too bassy. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go to the Sony Vegas. I'm gonna even add yet another EQ. So I go here, and I look for EQ, track EQ, there we go, add it, okay, and let's take even more bass off. Like this. So this is the bass again. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. And I'll push up the middle again. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry. All our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. So that's beginning to sound a little bit more like a telephone voice. Um, again, I think what I want to do is perhaps um, extend these top frequencies a little bit and see if that bring up a bit more on the 2K side. Let's just see. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. 
Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. And I think that's sounding pretty good for the moment. The, I'm going to have to bring the volume down just a little bit more because each time I've lifted the mid frequencies it's increased the overall volume so I don't want it to overload at this point. So another little play. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Now on the voiceover I'm just going to shorten this gap here because often these things are a little bit quicker. So I'll put a little gap in, uh, gap in, edit mark there, remove this chunk and slide that up and see what that sounds like. Just shorten the lead in. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry. All our opera. And I'm going to shorten this one too. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with And I'm going to shorten this one. I probably should have just read it a little bit quicker. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in. And shorten this one. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to, in both cases, save these presets so that I will, because I we're needing to, I'm going to put a bit of music in as well. So I'm going to want to give the music the same effect. So what I'll do is I will call this telephone one and save it. And I shall go to the other track EQ. This was my first EQ. This audio now has two lots of EQ on it and I shall save this one as Telephone 2 just so I can quickly bring it back. There we go. The compressor settings I, I won't save because I will probably manually set the music with a different setting. So what I'm also going to do for realism's sake is bring in the call tone onto a separate track and this is it. This won't need any EQ because I actually recorded this call tone um, from a telephone. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to have it ring, 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 ring and on here halfway through a ring I'm going to have it answered. So I'll just move this one out of the way for the moment. So I need to move these ones along. So you can do that by a single click on the thing, then you hold the shift key and click the end one, and then you can wonderfully drag them all in. So I'm looking to have the voice come in just after the, the broken click. So I'll just play this from the front and see how it sounds. In fact, I think I want to shift that along a bit further. Let's have on a bit more of a broken gap. So single click, shift, and click, and drag those along a bit more. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. Right, okay, I think that's sounding roughly okay. Then what I'm going to do now is bring in the music because you always get a bit of music from the call center. And this music is coming down onto the third track so I can uh, manipulate the sound I might want to. So I'll just play the music. <laughs> certain little piece. Oh, there we 
we are. I wanted to start on this. So I put an edit mark in. I'll remove this beginning bit. And I'll shift this up to here. That little blue line you saw flash up. The wonderful thing about Sony Vegas is it knows it, where the previous and various other edits are. So it will give you a little reminder as you move it along, it will flash up a little blue line. And by doing that, I know that's now in line with this. I'm just going to move that out of the way. That's the ringing which I'm going to use a bit later. So here we go. All our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. Right, so the music's too loud and I'm also I'm going to be doing a bit of EQing but first of all I'll compress it because again telephones are very compressed sound so the first one I'll do is the uh, track compressor. I'm setting uh, the amount, in this case I'm setting it to about 5 dB um, so what's going to happen is first I've got to move the threshold down for the machine to start operating and as I move the threshold down when it senses sound going over zero it will start squeezing it down and at 5 dB it would be quite aggressive but not too aggressive so what I'm looking for now and I'm not even listening to it I'm looking to see some healthy red lights glowing I will turn the music up go that's healthily that sounds a bit like a telephone and if I start bringing in the EQ um, if I go to EQ number one and set the preset telephone one and I've also got to add another EQ because I did two EQs on the voice so add okay and this will be set to preset telephone two so let's see how this is sounding your call is held in a queue. Far too loud. Let's try this now. Here we go. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. So what I'm doing now is I'm just going to play it back. I think I can bring up the original dining tone a bit. I think the voice level is probably okay at the moment. And the music, I think, is a little bit too loud. So I'm just going to make some adjustments as I go. So I think that's sounding all right. What I'm going to have, have do now, or I'm going to do have, <laughs> is I'm going to have a little bit of music and then a few more rings, you know, just, just so you think you're getting through to an operator. So I'll just play the music and decide where to bring the rings in. I think I'll do it there, just so the music sounds interesting. So I'll put a little cut in the music and I'll shift that up there. Next, I'll drag down the ringtones and again, I'm going to just 
on this one I'm not going to have it I'm not going to have it start right at the beginning I'm going to just have it a little break in a bit just to give an authentic little bit of realism and I'll, I'll butt it right up to the music and see how that sounds <laughs> Again, uh, halfway through the third ring, I'm going to put a cut in. I'm going to shift that out the way. And I'm going to copy the voice. So it's single click, hold the shift key, then go control C, and I've copied all that now. So just up here, just above that ring, I shall put it in. See how this sounds. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. And then the idea is bring the music back to here. Held in a queue. Now Another little trick you can do to sort of uh, smooth it all off is to drag in some noise, which is what I'm going to do next. I'm going to add another audio track. There we go, another audio track. And I'm going to drag in some white noise. White noise is just a general background hiss. But because white noise contains all frequencies, I am going to uh, have to run it through the equalizer to remove all the bass. So onto the equalizer and let's remove all the bass. I'll leave the top for the moment because I think that, that won't be too bad. Oh, I'm going to have to remove some of that top. Push the middle up. I'm just going to put another a couple in, then I'll master it off and join in the mixed one for you to hear. Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue.
Thank you for calling. I'm sorry, all our operators are busy at the moment. Someone will be with you shortly. Your call is held in a queue.